Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up your Galaxy Tab 4 10.1. Now first, of course, you're going to choose the language you like, then you're going to hit start, and then you're going to connect to your Wi-Fi location. You only want to set the tablet up in a Wi-Fi location or else everything just won't go that smoothly. So I do recommend you do set it up again in a Wi-Fi location. So we're just going to enter in the password right here. And then we're going to connect. And once we are connected, we can go to next. And then you'll see it'll automatically set the time. And then you do have to click I understand and yes, or else you can't go any further. And this is a very important part. Uh, you do have to have a Google account. So um, the, what this means is this is the only way you actually get apps. And of course, can use uh, Gmail, which is the best email service out there. So, uh, but mainly, if you want to ever use, an, if you ever want to download apps, you do need a Google account. So you will need to create one if you haven't already. I do, of course, have one. So we will just sign in right now. And then once we sign in, it will say, of course, this will take a few moments. And then we can continue. As you can see, if you have had a uh, previous device, phone or tablet, it will restore, which will take some time because this is basically downloading every app you had uh, previously installed on a similar device. And then you put in your first name and last name to personalize it for you. And then you're going to sign into your Samsung account. So for the Samsung account, uh, what this will allow you to do is use Samsung apps. Now, the main reason you want to do this is because Samsung offers an amazing office for you that is pretty much identical to Microsoft Office. So this is why you want to create an account. Uh, so we're just going to sign into the account again. And then Sign in. And then once you are signed in, you will then have that. Now what Samsung also gives you is for Dropbox, uh, it gives you 50 gigs for two years. I myself have an account with about 200 gigs because of all the devices I own. However, uh, this is a really good service just for sharing items uh, to other people that have Dropbox. So I recommend you uh, do sign in normally, but for right now we'll skip it. And then you can name your device. Uh, we will name this one Android. Guy. Tab four. Oops. 
10.1. And there you will have it. As you can see, it restored my background simply because of the fact that I had a previous tablet that had uh, that background. And that is how you set up the Galaxy Tab 4 10.1. Make sure to check out other videos as in uh, how to speed up the device and how to uh, improve your keyboard. If you have any other questions about this device, feel free to ask. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.